Thank you. Oh, come on! Another one? Oh, yeah. Oh, there were three now. Is now there's only one I have to kill. All right. Yeah, good. So we need to learn this. the fuck? Like, the attack doesn't make any sense. No. <laughs> fuck you, bitch. That's right, I won. Guitar motherfuckers. They're really going at it. Take that shit, dude. See it. Yeah, two modifications in that one. Ignore up a hundred armor. I'm gonna try that. Jesus Christ. What the fuck are you doing, dude? They're having sex. This dude is seriously messed up. <laughs> he's not gonna stop until he finds a way to become normal size again. That means he's coming after you, Warlock. What? Wow, fuck! <laughs> wow, fuck! Fuck me! Fuck me, you fucking cocksucker! Come on, fuck me, I said. That all you got, what bitch? Yeah, call me bitch. Cry? I just did, you dirty little bitch. What yeah, the fuck. I'm a dirty bitch. Wanna see me in the panties? What the? I could be collecting underpants right now. No way! Magic, bitch! <laughs> Magic, bitch! Yeah. Ah, so... uh. Even more slowed. Out. It's cool though. <laughs> Fuck a day. I wish I'd spend more time gathering underpants. <laughs> What's up with the underpants?
take all. Close. I'm not changing your back. I don't care what you do to me. Hey, come back here, little fucker. Oh no, don't go up there. You couldn't just let it go. Oh. You couldn't just let us pick your underpants. No! You had to go and start asking questions! Well, now you shall see the true power of an underpants now! The fuck? Dude. Now you've done it, fucker. It's time for some real underpants magic. Those are titties. That's your mama's titties. Just because I'm small doesn't mean you can ignore me. It's not alright. Not cool, bro. Oh, immune. Pig fucker. Oh, fuck me. Balls. Ah! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Ow. Oh, that did nothing. Here comes some serious trinkets. No. Ah! Ugh, my balls. Ah! <laughs> Cookies. You're dead now, boy. What? I wish I'd spend more time gathering underpants. Shut up. That's not okay. That's not cool, man. Oh, poor, poor dude. Well, that was not a dream you just had. Wait. <laughs> he snorted it. Hello. Come on, son. Get out there. Make friends. Watch out for strangers. Yeah, like you care. Hey, there's an emergency meeting at the Elven Forest. Huh? Oh. <coughs> <laughs> oh, I think I ran the wrong way. Not. Oh, all right. You ever wonder what it'd be like to be a dolphin? Just doing flips, no. eating fish, yeah. and not a care in the world? I have not. Where is the fuck? Give me a 
fast travel thing. Thank you. Places. Oh. Okay. Ah, Commander Douchebag has decided to bless us with his presence. Let's get started. Humans and elves of Zaron, a great evil has descended upon us. After researching last night, I believe we are facing a threat to our entire world. Clyde's Fortress of Darkness is over four stories tall. So far, he has recruited at least 50 warriors to be on his team, and he is... You have something to say, wizard? So, nothing. Just think it's kind of funny how drow elves in the Middle Ages can use PowerPoint. <laughs> you are serious! Clyde is attempting to raise an army of darkness. I believe he is messing with something he cannot control. He has recruited many of our friends, and so... Our only hope is for our two factions to join forces. Fuck that. We do not team up with fucking elves. You got a better idea, wizard fat ass? After what you elves did us at the Battle of Wormsley Woods, you think we'll ever trust you? Yeah, you, you tell a butter that that was Jimmy's fault and he apologized. Oh, oh, we're apologizing now. How about we apologize for breaking the rule about using arcane fire magic? Yeah. Hey, that was the human's rule, not ours. Join forces, my paladin ass. Only good elf is a dead elf. Why don't you suck my elven dick, butters? Enough! <laughs> Whether we are human or elf isn't gonna matter one bit if all of Zaron is taken over by German zombies. We saw what that green stuff does. We better figure out a way to stop Clyde or there won't be a world to fight in. Even if we join forces, we don't have enough warriors. So we recruit more factions to join us. The pirates, the Federation, and the girls. The girls? Kyle, the girls are not gonna fucking play with us. Yeah, dude, we can't convince girls to do this. No, but maybe the new kid can. The new kid has a power we have yet to understand. He makes friends on Facebook faster than any we have seen. He is really good at getting Facebook friends. I'll give him that. Find the way to get the girls to side with us, Commander Douchebag. I'll deal with the other factions. The rest of you, return to your stations and prepare for war. Huzzah! Okay. We elves craft the finest shit in the land. Cool. Flare. Yeah, no. Strap ons. Boring. And we are going. There. So. It's fast travel there. Hey, new kid. Shut the fuck up. What is this? The boys want us to play with them? I do owe you one. I can take you to the girls, but I don't think they'll be very willing to play with boys. Do you wish to speak to the girls now? Yes. Oh, really? Wow, okay. It's not normal. Holy shit. The 400th oh. and 12th meeting of the girls is hereby called to order. Sparkle, sparkle. Sunshine! Sunshine, sparkle. Millie Larson has the floor. If it pleases and sparkles, I move that we vote immediately on the urgent matter involving Monica Ryland. Yes! Yeah, yeah, right, 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 right away! Excuse me, I'm sorry, but I have an urgent matter that I believe needs to be addressed first. The chair acknowledges Annie. Sunshine, sparkle. Annie Nitz has the floor. If it pleases and sparkles, a messenger comes with a request from the boys. Yeah. Yeah. Ew. 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 Yes. What request do the boys ask of us? What the fuck is he going on? He doesn't really talk. That's hot. The boys are playing some new role-playing game, and the new kid here wants us to join his team. What? We don't have time for that. Something very big happened, and we must do something. I know. I thought maybe he could help. Oh, that's not a bad idea. I glitter Annie's idea. Sunshine Sparkle, a motion has been glittered to have the new kid help with Monica Ryland. All right, new kid, look. There are terrible rumors going around town that our good friend Allie Nelson was spotted at the abortion clinic. I have never been to the abortion clinic. I'm not a whore. 
We aren't sure, but we think the girl spreading the rumors about Allie is Monica Ryland. And then she has the gall to act all nice to me. We have to know for sure if Monica Ryland is a two-faced bitch or not. So, we're gonna send Monica a Facebook page with your picture, then tell her that you're Bebe's boyfriend from Lakewood, and you want to meet her and ask her what the best thing to get Bebe for her birthday would be, and see if Monica tries to hit on you at all, because that way we can see if Monica is a manipulative bitch. Right. What? Do this task for us, and the girls will consider your request. Sparkle! Sunshine! Wait. What just happened? I didn't understand any of that. You'll find Monica waiting for you at the park. All you have to do is pretend to be Bebe's long-distance boyfriend. When the job is done, come see me. Um... Whatever they ask you to do, remember we need their help. Okay. Wait. German soldiers, dude. I'm gonna kick your fucking ass. Okay, I can't. You should head over to the park. Monica will be waiting. Uh, okay. Park. Where is that? Okay. Playground. That's so much what it is, I would say. If shit goes down, I'll come running. Yo, what's up, girl? How you oh, doing? Hi. You must be Mike. So, you want to talk about Bebe, huh? Well, look, Bebe's my friend. I think she's really great. I, I don't know if she's the end-all be-all of girls. I mean, she's a little two-faced if you ask me. But, hey, I've read a lot of your Facebook profile, and I think you're a really interesting boy. Aha! Uh -huh. We knew it! You two-faced manipulative whore! What the heck? Thank God we sent the new kid to spy on you, huh, girls? Yeah! Now we know you're a two-faced bitch! What do you mean? You guys are my best friends! Then why are you hitting on my Facebook boyfriend? We brought someone else who might be interested. Monica, what the fuck are you doing? Uh-oh. Hey, Jake. Have fun, you two-faced skank. Huh? Guys, wait, what? please, come back! What's the big idea trying to fuck my girlfriend? What? Nothing to say, huh? Well, maybe you'll understand this! Oh, come on. Ah, oh, Jesus, not again. Ugh. Oh. God, dude, I feel the same. Who cares? Ah. I don't wanna fuck your skanky girl, dude. Marked for death. Go get him, boy. You asked for it. Yeah. Haha. <laughs> Ow. Dead. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, spit that blood out. Hiding is fun. I'll hide better next time. Shut the fuck up. Oh yeah, we're going there. Uh... I heard some kids trashed the school last night. <sighs> yeah, I heard the same. So, someone. Timmy! Timmy! Fuck off. Didn't mean to kill it. The girls want to thank you for your help. We can go see them. All right, then, let's go. You know the drill. It's with the blindfold, though. I mean, come on. New kid, we want to thank you for helping us determine whether or not Monica was a two faced bitch. She really made us mad, but it turns out she couldn't have been the one spreading rumors about Allie Nelson going to the abortion clinic. Yeah, so we made up. You guys are the best. You see, the thing is, Heidi Turner was supposed to put on the Facebook page that you were Bebe's boyfriend, but she didn't. Because Heidi Turner is a two-faced bitch who says she likes me, then tries to stab me in the back. Right, so we need to know if Heidi Turner is the two-faced bitch who's spreading rumors about Allie being spotted at the abortion clinic. But in order to do that, we need people to think you're a girl. Makeover! What? Makeover! What the fuck? Uh... 